Yes, okay, so I, I live in Flagstaff. <laughs> What's great about this channel, guys, is I get to show you whatever I want. This one is actually just all about helping you guys with your social skills. What I want you guys to pay attention in this video isn't necessarily the humorous aspect, but the social skills. The way that I carry myself, my body language, how I approach, how I make jokes, how I engage in a conversation, and how I also don't invade too much on the space of the other person. And essentially, not try and just get a girl's phone number and potentially go on a date with them or get into a hookup scenario, but just see what they're like as a person to be a friend. Maybe somebody potentially to date in the future, but I hope you guys enjoy this video. Drop a like right now. Oh yeah. Hey you. What's going on? Hi, Mike. Awesome yeah, what do you got there? It says tomato repetitions. It's kind of, what are the ingredients? What are you making something? <laughs> no, it's actually in Spanish. That says formato, but um, I'm just writing some notes that I can pass. Oh, dope. Okay. So. I was just listening to some Joe Rogan. Yeah, yeah I, I love yeah. Joe Rogan. I've never listened to him. No? Oh, it's actually really good. I used to be like that uh, for a while, but I played out the songs so much, you know, like I... Yeah, I do that too. I like just listen to one song mm -hmm. for like a month, and then I'm like, oh yeah, I'm definitely sick of that. Do you work out at all? Um, I do, yeah. I go to a gym by my place. Oh, okay. I, uh, when you work out, it's like good opportunity to listen to like audiobooks, podcasts, yeah, stuff like that. I didn't even think about that. Yeah. I should do that. Pro tip for you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, what's your name? Brie. Ooh, that's a cute name. Thank you. Yeah, I like your whatever the f that is. You know? Oh, my braid? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Do you think I should braid my hair? What do you I think? I definitely think you could. I, I vibe with braids. Yeah. It's getting kind of greasy, honestly. I'm going to brush my hair quick. I got to get going in a minute. I won't waste your... You look like you could use some company. Do you have class? Uh, no, I'm just going to meet some buddies. Yeah. I was actually dead ass about brushing my hair. I can't believe you carry a, a hairbrush in your backpack. I don't think I've met a man that carries it. Did you just assume my gender? I, I did. I'm sorry. I, I shouldn't have done that. No, it's okay. I'm a man. <laughs> I'm a straight man, baby. Um, Are you straight? Ah. Loaded question. Ooh, okay. Well, you assume my gender, so I assumed your sexuality. How about that? There you go. Are you straight? No. Oh. Much no way. Yeah. Damn, that's kind of gay. It is, actually. <laughs> See what I did there? <laughs> Alright, well, you want to be friends? Um, I can totally be friends? Yo, let's be friends. I need more gay friends. That yeah, way, when I, I get canceled. I well, I, I'm not going to meet you at the tree, but... You meet me at the tree? No. Why? This is my tree. Well, I mean... It's a pretty nice tree. It's a nice tree. I just can't guarantee I'll be here at those times, fair you know? Fair enough, fair enough. Do you have, like, Instagram? I do have an Instagram. All right. How about... I'll send you some, uh, I'll send you some Joe Rogan. How about that? They're trying to cancel my guy, but he's the best. <laughs> I did hear they were trying to cancel Joe Rogan. Nah. <laughs> He ain't getting cancelled. Everybody else is getting cancelled. That. So what's it like banging chicks? It's none of my business. Banging chicks? Well, don't you bang chicks? Well, yeah, but it's different when you do it. Totally different. I would have to agree. Yeah. I did follow myself, so I just don't want it. Whoa, you look different in here. I haven't posted for a while. Yeah. You know what? Social media is bad for you anyways. Yeah, it is. I make sure to set my limit to an hour a day. Good for you. Yeah. You look like you thrift a lot, eh? I do. I'm, I'm a big thrifty. thrifter too. Um, I go... Yeah, well, look at this. Yeah? This is thrifted too. I'd be so down to go thrifting. Yeah? You want to yeah. thrift sometime? Yeah, totally. Just DM me on Instagram and I'll send you my number and we could go thrifting because it's like my favorite. Yo. Yeah. Hit some Goodwills? Yes. I know, like, Fuck three yeah. Places. Three? So Do you know where the are? No, I haven't been to the here yet. You've heard of the Yes, okay, so I, I live in Flagstaff and we mm. have a big one and it's, you 
know it's not the best, but like I've been wanting to go to this, a big one here because I know like in Scottsdale sometimes you can get mm, stuff. some Patagonia, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Well, what I'm trying to get my hands on. not a big Patagonia guy, but the the good stuff you can flip, you know. Yeah, that's what I'm in. thrift Patagonia. You actually seem really genuine. I. I'll be honest, so I'm a YouTuber, and I do, like, funny videos, so my buddy's filming over there, and that whole interaction was just, like, so nice and so genuine, but I actually do want to be friends with you. Yeah, because he works at a thrift store back home. Does he really what thrift store? It's called Omnis. Let me show you. Yeah. Let me show you. Yeah, we do, like, funny videos. Um, What's your YouTube? It's called Jack Denmo, so this is Omnis, so this is the stuff that they flip. Go ahead, scroll through there. That's dope. We actually hit a Goodwill the other day, and uh, I, I dead ass copped this shirt. I love it. I like. I go all the time, probably every weekend. It's like my favorite stress reliever. Hmm. So. But yeah, we just do like funny YouTube videos, go up to people, have interesting conversations. It helps people like learn how to be social, talk to others. I appreciate that actually. Yeah, it makes me money too. There you go. You know, it's. The value's on both sides, but um, yeah, dude, we should totally thrift. That'd be dope. I'd be so down. Well, I hope you have a really good day. Thanks, you too. I hope that you uh, get your shit all studied or whatever. And cast tomato, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'll see you around. What was your name again? Bree. Bree. John. Nice to meet you. Friends call me Jack, though. You get the real name. All right, I'll see you later. Wow, what a, what a nice girl. That's what makes this job great, guys. You just talk to people all day and you make friends and then you go thrifting. Dating's very complicated. You can break it down into many different categories, but what I excel best at is the social aspect, as well as building you up on the inside so that you can have that confidence when you go and approach girls. I made a full seven hour course where I have dozens of clips just like this that I break down in extreme detail, teaching you everything from how to approach the girl in the first place, how to warm up socially to actually engaging in the conversation, what to talk about, how to use observational humor. I essentially help you guys learn the skills that I do in these videos and I put it into a course. And this course will take you from somebody that's not very social, not very confident, into somebody that can do that. And that's very valuable because when you are good at talking to strangers, particularly girls that you are afraid to normally talk to, then you can talk to anybody, guys. And those skills carry over into starting a business, they carry over into sales, handling conflict with men. And I have all of this information that I've learned over the last five years built into this course. So the course is in the link below. I recently uploaded new videos into there because anytime I think of some really crucial insights or new advice that you guys can learn from, I put it in the course. So go and check that out right now. Also, for those of you that need direct one-on-one -on -one help, I do have coaching services available. There's a lot of you guys that are going through a rough time. You don't have the confidence to go and approach somebody you want to find a way to improve your life so that you have better options maybe you need specific advice related to your mindset your inner confidence or you just want to get a girlfriend and you want to know the steps to improve your life and change things that you're doing that aren't working I've coached hundreds of guys and the guys that I find find the most benefit from this are usually dudes in their 20s or 30s that have a purpose they're working towards something in their business life but they have major approach anxiety they aren't able to get with the women they want to. They don't actually have a girl in their life that's providing value to them. It's not going the way they want to. So if you'd like to book a one-on-one -on -one call with me, go to the link in the description. I still have about 50% availability and I look forward to hearing from you guys. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Make sure you hit the like button, drop a comment below. Let me know what you guys want to see next time. This video is pretty silly. The idea is like just asking people if they like Joe Rogan and then trying to get their phone number, but it worked. And I'm actually surprised how many people aren't aware of Joe Rogan. So hope my guy gets a couple new listeners. I know the world's trying to cancel him right now, but they're wrong. He's uncancelable. Shout out to my guy, Joe. All right, I'll see you guys next week. Peace. All right, Jimbo. Let's roll out, dude.